So the question was uh, to, um, uh, about writing for the stage versus writing for the screen, and specifically what kind of stories work best for, uh, for each of those. I don't know. I mean, I, I feel like they're, very, they're different mediums, but fundamentally that you're writing scenes for actors. Which is, you know, which is the key thing that you have to do, and that is transcendent. Um, I feel like it's every story has every story is a certain length, and every story is a certain thing. You know, I mean, I think the strength of the stage is is a kind of like it's such a crucible. Like the thing has to be the essence of itself on stage. I really do believe that, whatever in whatever form it is. Like the stage doesn't support. Um, it doesn't support lying well, in a weird way. Like you, you, like you really know what's what on stage because there's no trickery except you know the tr great trickery of the actor and and other magic. But I feel like the writing for the stage is so essential. Like it, you only can have essentials on stage. Um, it's not like a novel which is can be very digressive. And I think you know I I. I just think writing for the screen is different because it's a different set of tools and you, it's a different feeling. But the feeling of writing for actors is the same, but it's a less, um, it's less theatrical. <laughs> um, the three of us ha have, uh, before the province now, a, tri a, a tripartite uh, proposal for an MFA in <clears throat> excuse me, dramatic writing. So it's, it's um, film, television, and theater, all as part of the same MFA. So everyone will, will, will dive into all of it. But at the heart of it is much what more one was saying. It's still telling a story. Um, and you start with the story, and then you, and then you figure out, w would it be better on the stage? Would it be f fuller or freer on film or TV or whatever? Um, but you, as Morin said, you're writing stuff for actors, and that's what's exciting. Um, and, and, and then you'll figure out what, what medium it works best on. Sometimes it works great in all of them. <clears throat> yeah. uh, the great thing about, the one thing that's satisfying about television is that you can stay with characters over time. That's incredibly satisfying and very unique, is that you can spend a really long time, and, uh, and, and that's, that is one thing that is super enjoyable. I would even leap in and say that for me personally, the best dramatic writing in the last 10 years is not stage, is not film, it is television. And that's one of the reasons why, because that Shakespearean arc of. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's energy. Like my plays are all like an hour long, and it takes me three years to write them. And it's really different to tell 18 hours of story. It's a different, like an amazing, amazing gift. And if you're a playwright and you get the chance to do it, it's really, really worth doing because it, it's, it's, it's a whole, you'll never get to do that unless you're Robert Lepage, <laughs> who's not a playwright. Yeah, he doesn't write, he doesn't create characters. Yeah, exactly. I'd also obviously like to thank the playwrights themselves. So if you could please join me in giving them a round of applause.